All right, I'm gonna pick this one a little bit immature, but just to show you what it is, it's a, it's a beautiful beefsteak style tomato. The tale of this tomato begins in the 1930s. Hard times left a West Virginia auto mechanic struggling to pay his mortgage. He looked to his garden for a cash crop and crossbred a perfect tomato. He sold each individual plant in the 1930s for a dollar a piece, which is you know, unheard of. That's a lot of money back in the 30s. So he sold enough of these tomato plants to pay off his $6,000 mortgage, and hence the name, the Mortgage Lifter. One reason the tomato fetched such a high price was its phenomenal flavor. The other was its amazing size. These babies, if you grow them well, they can get two and a half pounds. They can actually, I've heard some people growing up to four pounds. I've never seen it done yet. I'm still trying myself. In the squash bed lies another treasure. So this one I have to show you. This is known as the Kushal squash, or Kushal pumpkin, as some people like to say. See, the American Indians were growing this pre-1492. So, man, this thing has been around for quite a long time. But this one will have a nice sweet flavor to the meat on the inside. Are you guys ready to help me today? Yeah! yeah! All right. Today, Joe is passing on his gardening secrets to some young visitors. He's teaching them how to prepare the ground for a new crop. See all these roots down here? Yeah. yeah. We're going to be just pulling it straight up like that. You can either hit the roots on the ground to, we want to get all that soil off of there. Oh, this is great, working with the children. I love it. Any, any age, really, but the five-year-olds, four-year-olds, they just really get excited. They don't mind getting dirty. They don't mind having insects crawling on them. They're like sponges. They just want to absorb it all. <laughs> 